are wide and slight, so I'll switch and slide through the ferry and crash and as they maneuver through the muck. And they do spend a lot of time out of the line, as you can see, uh, this guy up here. And uh, he still has some mud cakes on from yesterday's wall. Oh, you missed it. You missed it. You missed it. He is. In the ground. Because he just moved. Now, because of their ability to do a sort of marsh environment without sinking, they're very useful on the Arm Society standards out these days uh, because they don't sink into the mud like uh, horses. I know. Horses. I know. Horses. 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 <laughs> mud coming out moment. Yeah, you see that? Mud coming off of him. Yeah. <laughs> now as the day goes on and gets a little bit hotter, assuming that uh, that's the Hi buddy, how you doing? Head to the mud pit up towards the north end of the field. Where it'll spend pretty much all day. Other animals. Soft. Nice no. Soft. 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 no, it's very rough. Of course. Oh, it's here. Yeah. How are you? How are you doing? You like so there's supposed to be some in that hand. Yeah, right. Sorry, I don't have anything for you. You eat the grass anyway. Yeah, look at the size of the hooves in there. Look at the bottom of that one over there. The one that's on the floor. No. You can see the bottom.